let's get to this daily dish. There's uh, always something going on at the Mississippi Valley Fairgrounds. And here to tell us more about it at this weekend's event in this segment sponsored by the Mississippi Valley Fair is Craig Meads from the National Street Rod Association. How are you, man? Doing great. Welcome Doing to great. the show. Welcome, man. This glad, is great. Glad to be here in Quad yeah. Cities. Yeah. So let's start with this, man. Tell us about the National Street Rod Association because I, 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 I'm super curious. Okay, well, it's been around since 1970. It was started by Rod and Custom Magazine. And uh, 1971, they had their very first Street Rod Nationals. And just two weeks ago, we had the 55th Street Rod Nationals in Louisville, Kentucky. We had wow. little over 9,000 cars at the event. And so this is our first time coming to Quad City, so it's the very first Quad City Street That's Rod awesome, Nationals. Man. I love that, love man. It. That's okay. great. It's, so tell us a little bit more about the event and what it's all about, what folks can expect. Well, one, you expect a lot of cars. Uh, most of the cars are 30 years old. All the cars have to be at least 30 years old and okay. older. Okay. Okay. So, uh, but our core membership is pre-1948, 1948 and older. That's the core of the National Street Rod Association. That's where street rods come from. Okay. Um, hot rods, very similar, but hot rods were originally designed to be drag race cars. Mm -hmm. And the guys wanted to be able to drive them on the street, and so they made them street legal, and they called them street rods. So okay. that's kind of where the hot rod street rod thing comes together. But you'll see muscle cars, um, classic cars, a little bit yeah. of everything out there. Uh, this weekend and then we also have an automotive swap meet one really cool thing we have is uh, a pinstripers panel jam by the pinstriping icons and they'll they'll okay. be pinstriping things all kinds of things mm -hmm. and then they'll put it up, up for auction and all the money from the proceeds of the auction go to the humane society here in the quad cities oh that's awesome, awesome. Man. i love awesome. that and you know what what does this event offer that you know if people don't know anything about cars like i did not know until you came in here this morning and told me what the difference right. between a hot rod and a street rod was uh, you know, what is there an educational aspect to this that people, if they don't know a whole lot, they can kind of come learn about? Just talk to one of the car owners. That, that's just, I mean, <laughs> dude, that is more valuable oh, yeah. than anything. They would love that too. Ask about their car and you'll get everything you want to know about it. Right. And, yeah. photo, and photos on their phone. So. And oh, they love sure. talking about oh, they, it. Oh, they, they, yeah. they do. Yeah. That's, that's really their, it's really their passion yeah. is, that, is that car and, and the, the lifestyle that they do with it. Uh, these folks travel all over the country with their cars. You wow. Know, so. Yeah. That's pretty neat. That it, is really cool. So, so how many cars and hot rods can viewers expect to see? Well, we don't know since this is the very first one. Okay. You know, I said two weeks ago we had 9,000. I don't suspect we'll get anywhere close to that this year, but I could say we'll probably have between 1,000 and 1,200 is what, wow. what we're wow. estimating. And they're street rods, Brandy, not hot rods. I know, you gotta, right? You gotta, I know. You gotta I know. get it right here. <laughs> but we have, you know, except for kids, there's kids games uh, going on. Yeah. Uh, we have an arts and crafts area. And then uh, in the afternoon, like Friday night, uh, starting at 7 o'clock, we have um, the night people will be playing music. They stick around until yeah. 10 o'clock. They'll play till 10 o'clock at night. And then on Saturday, starting at 1, we have uh, three-day rain. We'll, we'll play from uh, 1, to th 1 to 5. Okay, so yeah. it's more than just car. Oh, yeah, yes. it's a little bit of You got fair food. Yeah, oh, you can you love fair food. food. So. That, can you? <laughs> no. And how can someone uh, purchase tickets? And are, there, are there any discounts available? We love a discount. There are. You can purchase at the fairgrounds. Okay. Easiest way is to go to O'Reilly Auto Parts. Any O'Reilly Auto Parts store mm -hmm. in the country sells our tickets. Um, and you get a $2 discount if you go to O'Reilly's. Okay, uh, that's we good also, to know. We also have a, a family pack. If, now, the family pack you, you can only get at the fairgrounds. Okay. O'Reilly's does not sell those. And the family pack is two adults and up to three kids for $45. Wow. wow! Can't beat that. You know, yeah. and I, and I you stay all day. I mean, yeah, yeah. And I feel bad we didn't really ask about you, Craig. Let's t give us your elevator pitch on who Craig Meads is, because you know, I bet you're a give us some background. Uh, street you. rod, you know. <laughs> well, I have, a, I have a 1939 Ford Coupe that was my dad's. Oh, that's uh, amazing! My dad passed away when I was two, and I still have his car. That's awesome! Wow. So I've kind of had that car thing since I was very young. Yeah. Uh, my uncle was a big car guy, and so I hung out with him and his sons, you know, I growing up and they were real car people, so oh, just kind of oh grew up in it. Yeah, uh, your dad's looking down on, yeah. on you and thinking oh, that's, that's, so that's cool awesome. That you have that. That's awesome that's amazing, that you've kept man. that yep. through all these yeah. years. Yeah. And so you've just been into it ever since and been here you are since, yeah. with the NSRA. Look this is my 10th year with the NSRA. So that's awesome, man. Yeah, I love cool. that you turn your passion into a career and look at that. It's great. I love I get paid to go to car shows. Right? That's great, man. No doubt. No downside. No, yeah. definitely, oh, definitely. Man, I love that. That's well, cool. this was so nice to chat with you, man, and I hope everything goes well this weekend. Come on, see us at the show. Yeah, for sure, man. For sure. Yeah. Thank you again for coming <laughs> yeah, on. Thanks, Craig. Thanks. All right, again, this segment was sponsored by the Mississippi Valley Fair, and for more information, you can visit mvfair.com.